Okay, I've been here for a couple of hours now and no one's really stopped, but two born again Christians did and they were so excited to see these posters and they were on board with, with all of it. It, it flat earth the, the whole lot. And uh, you see this one has got information that Muslims need to know about. Oh, it's getting windy now, look, we we'll drop in. Uh, yeah, so, yeah, there was a bit of a commotion here on a Sunday. Uh, the, there was big crowds of people, you know, when something goes on and the, the crowd, they sort of surge. Well, that was um, Amy and Jono chasing Bob the Destroyer around the park. They were challenging him and of course he wouldn't engage. Uh, false teachers don't engage because they won't. And uh, the way to uh, handle uh, false teachers is to warn people about them. And it's uh, quite easy to uh, warn people about Bob because he's got quite a few videos and uh, he blasphemed against the turn the other cheek and he's calling for a crusade against Islam and people seem to like him some people like him for a very strange reason I can't work it out why because uh, mainly because I think they're not used to people in this country are not used to civil unrest if they if they knew what it was they would be horrible at you know, them um, people abusing horses over there <coughs> Yeah, I, I won't shout today. <laughs> I'll keep it a miss. In the mood. Uh, but yeah, so, yeah, just warn. People just need to be warned <laughs> about these teachers. And also, the, the people that are being, how can I put it, flamboyant here, that is a tactic. That is a tactic to prevent a good, good discussion, not a silly one where two groups of people just shouting at one another and trying to discredit each other. I mean, that's just ridiculous. But there's plenty to talk about. I came across something this week, actually. I was, I was like, what is this? How cheeky. Uh, the, it, the, it's, in the, it's in the Hadith, uh, not the Quran now. But see, again, you've got to be very careful about what you say. You know, people sort of flippantly run around saying the Quran, 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 and it's not the Quran, it's, a, it's actually a Hadith. But uh, anyway, so one of them says, day of resurrection comes, he will give every Muslim a Christian or a Jew to ransom from the fire. That's uh, 70 dot one, 11. Uh, 7012, 15. No Muslim man dies, but Allah causes a Jew or a Christian to enter fire in his stead. And this is really cheeky, it's 701451. Some Muslims will have sins like mountains, but Allah will forgive them and place the sins on the Jews and the Christians. So, you know, there's always that if you want to start a conversation with somebody, I don't. But, uh, but yeah, it's, uh, yeah, uh, Bob and his uh, muscular Christianity. It's, uh, it, it, it really is just, uh, I mean, you know, it's sort of funny, but it's not. But what can you do up here? But, but yeah, I'm so pleased to meet them and they might even come Sunday as well. So they really, really, it just really made my day to meet people that were like, yeah, we know all about this. And they said, they said, oh, you're so brave to do this. I don't feel brave. It's like, no one's ever said anything to me. But um, yeah, I'm out.